Hello, Jolyn Embrick, Home Farm Sherborne, Gloucestershire. Farming 900 acres on the Sherborne Estate and over the time I've been involved with um, Class Lexian range including 410, 440, 460 and a 570. 460 was the first Lexian combine I was uh, given to drive. It was, it, was a, it was a massive privilege for me to have, you know, been given this opportunity to drive a uh, 460 as my first combine. And it, it was a very steep learning curve as well. It was something that I will always remember and always look back on as being very lucky to, to have been given the opportunity to, to have started my combine driving on such a nice machine. So from the 460, we then went uh, to the 440 Evolution. But one of the biggest uh, improvements on the 440 at the time was in the form of the header with the, the Vario, which gave us tremendous improvement on crop flow, whether it was in short barley right through to the longest, tallest laid rate, it coped without any problems at all. From the 440, we then progressed to the 570C, which was a, a real game changer from an operator's point of view. We gained tremendous output. Not only had we, had we gone to wider widths with the header, but in testing conditions, especially with wet straw, we were gaining output where we were, we were struggling before to, to separate grain from straw, especially in, in good conditions. It, it really did come to life then. It was surprising the more we got to use to it and the more we became familiar with it and the more we pushed it, the more it would give us. It was also the first time we had a combine with Laser Pilot, um, which was a, a massive boon for us in the form of always having a full header, reduced operator fatigue. It was very noticeable how much easier it made the day combining. Um, and it also freed up the operator to fine tune the combine and get the optimum out of it. We were finding that it did also increase uh, performance and output purely through always having a full header throughout the day because of the, uh, the, the lower strain on the, on the driver. So coming from the 440 onto the 570 plus TerraTrack gave us Jetstream as well uh, which, uh, which gave us infinite adjustment in airflow and higher airflow when needed uh, for high output situations to keep, to keep the sieves clean and, and working at their optimum. As soon as we drove it out in the field, we noticed a big improvement on the stability of the machine with reduced wallowing in the field, which as a result gave us better auto contour response and of course compaction and traction improved uh, dramatically through having the tracks and uh, having to cross a very major trunk road kept the widths down and made crossing the road much easier and safer. Having variable rotor speed uh, combined with the, the bomb doors gives us plenty of adjustment to suit different crops, different situations, not only in different crops but the same crop throughout the day and uh, at, at uh, different times through the season uh, gives us plenty of uh, adjustment to uh, maximise the, the machine's output. Uh, with the 570 Plus we uh, gained a larger engine and grain tank, both of which have been an improvement on the sea, especially in uh, testing situations, especially when chopping and unloading um, in heavy, heavy crops. Another big improvement coming with the 570 Plus was the power spreader. It easily covers the 30 width cut uh, that we have on our machine and it will do wider than that, I'm sure. Uh, we, can, we can put a bias on it if, we, if we've got a crosswind. It, it does perform very, very well. 